I've gone on fa the fashion spot, that website, mm -hmm. and they said something. Oh, they said that I always had the same look or something like that. Um, and that they, they were sad because it didn't look like I was growing as a model. And, <laughs> well, it's, it's awful, but it didn't hurt because I was like, it doesn't matter what you think really because A, I'm not doing this forever and ever, so, and, so, that's no big deal, and B, I don't know you, so I don't care what they think, and, um, it doesn't matter if someone that I don't know says something about me because they don't know me. And I'm not gonna get all upset because there's no way I can ever meet them and prove to them that I'm not like what they think at all, you know? So I can't change their mind. So I'm not gonna get myself bent out of shape because of something that someone says. Um, but that's just the way that I am. I would, I would feel more offended if a friend said something like that because they should know better. And, um, but and then I guess at the same time, I would be mad for only a little while, but then I would realize that the fact that they didn't know better by saying that meant that they obviously weren't that good of a friend in the first place. I'm very apathetic with my friendships. It sounds really <laughs> cold and callous, I know, but I'm not the kind of person who's going to go chasing after somebody who doesn't want to be my friend, you know, or who just is not interested. Um, because that's just a waste of my energy. And if anything that I learned from modeling, I've learned not to stress. It was, it got to a point where it was so bad and I would stress about everything and I would just let it get to me. And I would be crying because I didn't want to do something and I had to go somewhere and I was traveling and I was had to catch a plane or, you know, whatever. And I was driving my huge suitcase around or it could have been anything and it could have been such a small thing too but then it just sets me off and I had to sit myself down and I said to myself you know what we're not gonna let it bother us <laughs> because I am not going to waste my life stressing out about something that is not a big deal to me you know that I'm only doing as a part-time thing I shouldn't be letting it get to me this much it shouldn't stress me out because Things in general shouldn't stress you out. And it, I kind of took that and I applied it as like a philosophy to my life now where I just don't worry or I try not to worry about things and I try not to stress because I'm not going to waste the time that I could be spent doing great fun things and time that I could spend being happy, being really, really stressed out about something. I apply that to midterms all the time. But I also have this very, like, you know, live and let live attitude when it comes to that sort of thing. I know that there are, like, if there are deadlines coming up for something, like I have a big test or I have something due, I'm not going to freak out, you know, because way back even when I was in elementary school, if I knew that I had a test coming up that I was scared about, I would think, you know, what if I called in sick, or wouldn't it be nice if I could just slip into a coma for a while? But obviously that can't happen. So I would always be like, you know, I, you, you can't spend your life dreading these things because the day will come and it will always come and there's no way you can stop it from coming. You will have to write that test or write that paper or whatever and you'll have to hand it in and then the day will pass and it'll be done. It'll be out of your hands. So there's no point freaking out. You can only do so much that you can before and then that's it. So I have a very chill attitude about it all now. I never used to but I just don't let it bother me. There are so many girls that I, or people in general that I know in um, my university gets so stressed out when it comes to midterm season and exam season and I'm sitting there and I'm like should I be stressing out right now because everyone else is freaking out and I'm like I'm not nervous or scared or anything maybe I should study more <laughs>